All right, so this is gonna be uh just chilling episode sixty nine. I think it's gonna be sixty nine. Let me double check. I got I got some time. Shit. Sixty nine. We <laughs> like getting ass. This is the ghetto podcast. The good number. <laughs> sixty eight. Sixty eight. Episode oh, sixty eight. Oh, hey. like I'm ass. living in the future, man. Niggas uh, getting old. Man. <laughs> shit, if this ain't good. episode sixty nine, I don't want to be on it. I want to make that a, yeah, a good one for sure. But yeah, it's gonna be 68 of the Just Chilling Podcast. Um man, turn it, turn it down. I think. Um, yeah. Man, this is the idea that I had right here was uh do I like a track for track uh type of battle deal. I feel like I done did enough promotion between me and Miss Hip Hop, so you know. If you're watching, you know, you probably didn't see the post or whatever. So, um, mm -hmm. man, we got Matt. We got uh, Big TJ. I'm going to call Big TJ. I know you've been feeling that work, man. Um, yeah, so soon, man, I appreciate that. We it. got Chat. And we got our judges, uh, Hershey <laughs> and uh, Miss Hip Hop. Ooh, um, ooh. Yeah, man, it's big, man. So, um, oh, yeah, before we got started, I didn't want to forget. Hershey going to give us some tales from the club. I really oh, yes. Let's <laughs> get it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Hershey going to give us some tales from the, from the club. I can't wait to see this shit. <laughs> this shit about to be hilarious. Hell yeah, that shit about to be okay. So, back a few years ago, you know, when I was on my little bullshit or whatever, um, I'm not going to say the name of the place I used to go to because I might need to use that place one day in the future. But I used to go to this place, and uh, basically it was like a bunch of older men that were like coming in from out of town on business trips and all this other shit. And I had a partner and we used to go in there and, you know, do our little thug dizzle, you know, play some men out of some money or whatever. But we got this one dude and he seemed super cool. He seemed super cool. And then I don't know if it was the cocaine or... <laughs> I don't know what it was, but he was like super geeked up on coke. And uh, we were like, all right, so then you go do this, we gonna wait. So we were in the room and he was like, I'm gonna go to the store real quick, which is like right across the street. So he went to the store, you know, he came back with regular stuff like some water and condoms and stuff like that. And then it just got out of hand. I don't know what happened. He, he came back with a bottle of Crisco, like the cooking oil, like, and I was like, ain't no kitchen in the room. So, like, what are you going to do with the go? Right. You know what I'm saying? So I started, we started tripping out. We just, all right, whatever. We're going to do our thing. Da, da, da. We're going to get in, get out. Da, da, da. So best part about it is he was super geeked up. He couldn't really do anything. But what he did do was start rubbing himself down in the Crisco. Like, <laughs> and I was like, what is happening right now? <laughs> I can't make this shit up. He was like looking in the mirror, like ah, like rubbing it on himself. And I was like, what did we just get ourselves into? Like, what's going on with the oil? So he starts doing all this and he can't, you know, he can't perform or whatever because he done did all these drugs. And we're like, okay, well, we're going to leave you with the Crisco. You know what I'm saying? Seems like you and the Crisco having a good time. And then that's not even the cake. Like he freaking had like the, he took the the thing off the condom, like the top part off, like the little ring part and like tied it around his balls. And like, <laughs> I started it's freaking it's out. I was like, I'm ready to go, I'm ready to go, I'm ready to go. <laughs> oh, no, it's weird, man. Oh, and this was a white man. So his whole like- <laughs> was he was white. Down. He, it was red and he was yeah, covered in oil. Really and I was just like concerned for this man. I was like, what is going on in your life that this is the type of shit that you went to with two strangers that you felt comfortable enough to go get a bottle of Crisco and start rubbing that shit all over your body. And not to mention when he started like trying to get like whatever he was trying to get like on us, like I'm just, I'm disgusted cause he's like rubbing Crisco oil on me from his body. And I'm like, you know what? We done. We yeah. Just yeah. Done. I'm, I'm out. <laughs> All right. We gonna come back later, but not really. Can we just get the? I don't care if we didn't do shit, but watch you rub yourself down in oil. Can I get my payment? So I, I know that's real. Payment on brand. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I came. You got to pay me for my time. I don't care about Period. Stuff, but you just tripped me out. And the funny thing is, is like after that, me and my friend, my partner Sunny, we did a um a photo shoot. 
And then this bitch came back with a bottle of Crisco. I was like, you know, all I kept thinking about was like how shiny he was and how good he would look <laughs> in, the, in, the, in the pictures that we was like rub ourselves down in Crisco. So <laughs> Hell no. so we really did that like we it was like actually a life hack that we got from fella so it was cool wow. I guess. <laughs> I like that. a life hack if you don't got no baby oil go get you some crisco oil yourself down for that photo shoot. I, imagine, I imagine y'all smell like chicken though make sure the light right now man you'd be surprised crisco actually doesn't have like a like a it's smell like an oily smell yeah, a little it's bit, awesome. but it was like I guess awesome. he used so much of it. It wasn't even the smell that we was worried about, to be honest. Right. It was not, the smell was not a concern for us. It was the <laughs> ham deal with that cooking oil all over his damn body. Y'all gotta give it up to her, man. That was a great fucking <laughs> Yeah, that shit was funny as hell. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I wish I would have seen it. That was, that was like, like the best ever. <laughs> camera, I should have recorded that nigga. Like, what are you doing? Yeah, true. <laughs> Yep. So, so yeah, um, man, like I said, we got great artists here. I'm very fortunate to uh, have these artists on here to do episodes to me, uh, to you know talk to me, you know about what they got coming out, whatever. But uh, like I said, I'm very appreciative. But the first round gonna be uh, Mint versus Chat, and um, the thing is about it, if um, if, if TJ is so soon, y'all can vote as well while y'all listening to track by track. So um, I don't have a coin with me. Do anybody got a coin to flip? See who can go first. I got a bunch of them. Hold on. I show you get a song. No coin, but I don't. Got a little change bag. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. 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 I knew hers was gonna have some change. Goddamn. <laughs> Everybody got some change. All right, I got my lucky little fifty cent piece. All right. Thanks. Heads or tails? Who gonna call it? I call it. All right. Tails. Heads. Heads. Yeah, check going like first. Tails, anyways. Okay, let's just get it. All right. <laughs> that means I'm going to my email to pick out a gutter. All right. So how's New Year's going for everybody? Oh, there you go, there you go. No fans, no fans. Yeah, vibing out, man. I came up out the gutter, yeah, that's word to my mother, ho. Only like the ratchet hoes that come straight out the gutter, ho. We do not fuck with this. It's in the gutter, ho. I always keep the marching bands, the drums will make you stutter, ho. The project breaks, they really made me suck a shit, could never face my mate it out the gutter. You would think them niggas glad I made it. Either way, that shit don't face me. Somewhat smoking Cali's greatest. Every night, my life a movie, we stay somewhere celebrating. My girl a queen and not a Barbie. I smoke green at Bob Marley. She popped a perk and went retarded. Now she trying to smash the party. No nigga put no fear in me. Always keep that fire with me. I keep it close. I keep it close like a Bible or a rosary. Always somewhere double cup. Better bitch won't try one of us. We come in so goddamn deep that you know that you bound to get jumped. Stop down to a goddamn pump. Youngins that don't give a fuck. That slang and bang and tote them things. Cause life ain't never gave a fuck. Chat Weezy, nigga. Yeah. Chat yeah. mix too, bitch. Go get it. Yeah. Yeah, a little freestyle. That shit cold. That's that just a little freestyle. I, I, like I like that. It. Fire. I don't know how you playing that bit like that, but it sound like it's inside the damn recording, like it's inside of here. Like, Man, I, I guess, that shit sounds good. Give me a hip-hop credit. Give me a hip-hop credit. We figured that shit out, man. Oh, yeah, y'all cold on that. Big proud move. Oh, so proud of me. Good one, good one. Good one. Good one. Good one. Good one. I'm so proud of Miguel. Like, I, I just gave him the video. The nigga figured it out. I'm like, thank you, God. <laughs> <laughs> whole, nerd, whole nerd over here. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> all right, so we, so we come back around with uh, all in the mix. I sound low. I sound low. That sounded good. Yeah. I sound low. <laughs> it's the intro. Oh, what is it? Bang it. I don't run with niggas, I don't need me a clip, but I keep 30 on me like I just saw the brick. And my bitches call me up, so cause I'm all in the mix. And I'm always in the 
in the studio, hit it after hit, then I'm feeling like I'm Dre, why I'm all up in the six, I don't like them running back, I don't like them reminisce, it's return of the Mac, like it's 1996, I like the riches so it rest, I might move to the rich. My main bitches is my side hoes Kick them all out through the fucking side door Nobody more important than this fucking studio I think my music more important than these groupie hoes I've been running birds out like I'm Julio Living against this paradise like I'm Coolio They never seen nothing like it through a Vizio I was a killer, I was just waiting on them to push me though Yeah, I'm like Jesse and I'm a slayer Can tell all the real ones from all these fucking haters But I cut these bitches off in the way of all my paper And I'm chasing all these bads, 24 8 like I'm a Laker I'm a with niggas, I don't need me a clip But I keep 30 on me like I just saw the brick And yeah, my bitches call me up so cause I'm all in the mix And I'm always in the studio, hit it after hit And I'm feeling like I'm Dre when I'm all up in the six I don't like them running back, I don't like them reminisce It's return of the Mac like it's 1996 I like the riches so it rest, I might move to the rest Ritz, blitz, honey round sticks Ritz, blitz, up and down switch Switch, switch, holding big clips, yeah we big clips, and we big lit. I'm a side, I'm a side, by my side, yeah we slide. I'm a side, I'm a side, yeah we slide, yeah we slide. I don't run with niggas, don't need me a clip, but I keep 30 on me like I just saw the break. And my bitches call me up, so cause I'm all in the mix, and I'm always in the studio. The hit, then I'm feeling like I'm Dre when I'm all up in the six. I don't like the running back, I don't like the reminisce. It's return of the Mac, like it's 1996. I like the riches so it rest, I might move to the Ritz. Buy my bitches big bags with some shoes in the meat. Been like 35 rats on her jewels in the feet. Got a bad attitude, yeah, she rude when she speak. Now I take it all back, never lose my receipts. Yeah, the Mac, black, dressed in all black. Overseas strap, running mean laps, almost relapsed, never need naps, playing freeze catch, never believe that. I don't run with niggas, I don't need me a clip, but I keep 30 on me like I just saw the brick. And yeah, my bitches call me up because I'm all in the mix, and I'm always in the studio, hit it after hit. Oh, that's a hard one. Yeah. yeah. That's hard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. This is a hard, like, this, hard. Man. this is a hard battle, hard. man, because they go together so fucking well, man. I, I had a man. great time listening to both of them, man. Me too. Nah, like <laughs> Chad, she was saying that shit. I like though. That's what I I'm mean, saying, yeah. Fine. And then he came with I do my little dancey dance beat, and I was like, oh. I like that shit all in the mix. I got to download that. Like, oh, <laughs> man. Oh, God. Yeah. All right. I'll right, I'll jump. I'll jump. I'll jump out in front. I gave it a mint, the first one, because his was longer. Chat did the freestyle, but Chat shit was cold, though. Hey, yeah. if, if I was the grade myself with that, I would have gave her the point. I mean, I'm just being suggestive because my you idea feel, the point, man. My, no, I'm just saying, because my idea feel kind of long compared to that, you know what I'm saying? But you know how I am with that. Yeah. That's, that's all the reason I, I gave I give him the point, because I like that song. That song is, is a hit, for sure. All the that song is a hit. Oh, okay. God. The chat went hard too. Though. Okay, like, so I just who started the second song. Freestyle, you know, who's the second no, your song? Shit was cold, though. You the second song was uh, metrical. Okay, yeah. Okay, because I was gonna say that the first song I really liked. You know, he, I mean, uh, Lindsay Chastity. You, you cold. You sound just like La Chat from Memphis. I hear that a lot. She I sound just it. like her, and she she cold as hell. She legendary, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. And so I, I really dug how you, you you stuck to Gucci Man's whole you know the vibe, yeah, the vibe, the lemonade vibe. You know what I'm saying? I respect that and shit like that. You ain't just go do your own thing. You just did it like how it's supposed to be. Pay that homage, done. man. Yeah, for sure. You paid homage to him. All right, y'all. Yeah. Local, local drug dealer, y'all. <laughs> the second, the second, second song, song, Metro, Fierty, that shit was dope because you came in talking about like I know you said you weren't trying to reminisce, but it was very repetitive, like 1996, you know, yeah. Return of the Mac, you know, Coolio, you know, you was all up in the mix and the vibe, like yeah. the, the song was saying. 
And you were saying that these records is more important than these hoes. And I like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking with both of them, man. Real talk. <laughs> but if I had to, if I had to just choose, like I can't lie, man. That song, that's real. That's real deal. Like a little hit. Like, not to take nothing away from Chad. I ain't gonna lie though. I ain't gonna lie though. This gonna be a crazy battle. This gonna be a crazy battle. As we go down, shit. I don't know. I'm trying to get right shit. That shit right there, like a little, some little shit that can just really go global, like on some label shit. Yeah, no, Loki. I heard that at the club. I was like, that. Yeah, I would dance to that. Okay. Yeah, yeah real like Chad for the combat with a uh, local drug dealer. Ain't gonna lie, I got some O's on now. I'm kind of scared now. I'm kind of scared now. <laughs> Life's kind of old. We kind of old. Local drug dealer. <laughs> Look, just call me the local drug dealer. Cause we keep the gas in the molly getting figures. White girl, white girl, yeah, she figures. Turn around and put the molly in her own liquor. Just the local drug dealer. Sand perks, man, whatever you can picture. Your local drug dealer. And we brought our drums and we got our own symbols. You can just call me the local drug dealer. Oh, no, Did you say you get put the Molly in her own liquor? Is that what you yeah, said? She said that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she said that, my nigga. Andy. I was like, what? <laughs> the white girl. Yeah, mm. this put it in her stuff. You ain't got roof for nothing, huh? That was uh-uh, crazy. I ain't had the roof for nothing. <laughs> hey, Miguel. What's up? Uh, Before we move on to our Met song, can we just make sure that um the background noise, like it's I'm hearing background noise and I yeah, let me know. get that. It's probably my kids. Yeah. Her she ain't so so. Start, start <laughs> trouble. I you know I listen. I'm an artist. We you Erica said it best. We sensitive about our shit. Like I like I'm walking back and forth and moving around, but I'm listening entirely. Yeah, um, I, I turn mine on mute, so I don't want I don't want to put yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't. Yeah, my lady not home, so I don't have to worry about background noise right now. So 
Okay. Yeah. All right. So this uh lavish. That's it, but I get her the point. Yeah. 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 Like that shit. Yeah, yeah, I see my anxiety, man. <laughs> <laughs> I already told you if I was picking away, my pull, my pull going. This shit crazy. This shit fly. Miss Hip Hop, what you got? That shit was dope as hell. It was like real melodic. Like, I don't know. It's always something like I already knew the song, I already heard the song before. Like, so that shit definitely is a hit. And it seemed like it's. <laughs> It's like real potent, you know what I'm saying? Like some good draw or some shit. Like you definitely hit that for sure. <laughs> <laughs> shit, Hershey, what you got? Um, I think that the first one, chats, was like good. I think the beat was a little messy. Like I could, like her message got across clear as hell. Definitely. But like it was the beat that kind of was like for me. I kind of like was trying to keep up with it. And then metrical, I like like I like I like your music. It's re it's really dope. Um, love, man, love. But that one kind of I feel like that one like it kind of overpowered your lyrics a little bit. Like as far as that your beat was concerned, like it was a fire ass beat, but kind of in the middle a little bit. Like I, it was kind of hard to hear what you were saying because the beat kind of got up over you. Yeah, that's early. That's early. That's early. That's early. I, I gave, I gave it, a, I gave it a chat because she was like, she was just like reminiscing on what, on what she doing, what she still doing. Yeah, when she just, said that, Molly, she told a great story. She said her lyrics. I kind of was like over it. When she said that, I was like, did she say for Molly in her own cup? <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, she lyrics, got me yeah. with that one. I think that, like, I think <laughs> that's went hard because she was saying it's real. I like that shit. Plus, you know, I like local drug dealers. Uh, uh, so soon, TJ, what y'all input in, man? <laughs> I like local drug dealers. <laughs> hey, I, I like bro music, man. It's real wavy. Like, I like that. That's true, that's but true. But on, on that time, I got to go I gotta go with chat on that one, you feel me? Yeah. Because I, I, I can relate to what she's talking on now. Miguel, I'm about to switch over on my um, 
laptop. All right, we're gonna need you in a minute. Hold on, I'm, <laughs> I'm doing it right now. I'm doing it right now. Hold on. Hurry up, Hershey shit. I know. I'm sorry. I just no, like no, it. no. You good? Just yeah, chill, podcast, man. Do what you got to do. Uh, <laughs> do what you right. got to do. Oh uh, yeah. I also picked chat too because I um I looked at y'all y'all um y'all list of songs and it's gonna be a nice ass battle. So I it's crazy it. the way it's playing out though. I wanted you know, to see it play it. out this way. Talk about drugs. Local drug dealer was talking about just drugs. <sighs> Hey, I, I just wanted to say I didn't I didn't give my thoughts about the first round, but I gave the first round to Matt because um, yeah, the like, first round was Matt. Chat chat had bars on it. Um, I'm I'm in this space where well, well one I just love a good song. I love good song composition, and I am um, also I'm in this space where you could just. So much more. Sorry, my I think I have my volume too loud. But you can just uh, nowadays you can access a high quality original production a lot easier nowadays than you could like ten mm -hmm. years ago. You know, so on and so forth. And so I know Chat um, went off on the Gucci Mane record, and and you did it. You did it. Mm -hmm. um, but I like I just for song production value overall, I gave the first round to Matt. Second round was like really tough I, I gave that to chat though because like you know for context i'm i am nothing close to a street nigga but i got him <laughs> close to me at all times and so i i get it vicariously I got him close to me at all times and, and, <laughs> and, and, <laughs> sure, you, i mean you know the, you know you know the deal and, <laughs> and like i can't relate to the music directly but for what i listened to that shit was just hard and i just like that shit had me rocking you know what i'm saying um i would even say that the beat for Met's second record, I enjoyed better than the beat for Chat's record, but the overall song composition, what Chat did on that local drug dealer beat, like that shit gave me the vibes that like, like, and then I also think about playback value, right? There's sometimes when there's like music that's good and it's like, it's good and you could just leave it there. And then there's music that's like good. And, and like for me, it's like when you listen to shit on the radio, it's good and you want to hear it again and you want to add it to your playlist or whatever and play it again. And that local drug dealer, that shit would hold a spot on my playlist for a minute. So I get they're, they're one and one for me right now. I think everybody is scoring kind of similar, but yeah, I would I'm just happy, say I'm that they're one that. and one for me right now. <laughs> yeah, me too. I'm happy about that. Me too. Okay. So Chad coming back with a real one. Real, huh? 
Yeah. <laughs> Yo. Man, what was it like making a video for this, man? Man, it was ass everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Big ass, little ass, skinny ass, it was ass. I didn't, I didn't play in that, for real. I, I love that video, man. Come, they baby, I forgot I lived in Vegas. Told them coming they bathing suits. Man, I had to tell the y'all, make sure you don't get that ass behind me. <laughs> it was a big flat ass, but it was fun. Hey, it was amazing, man. Yeah, before you play that, let me say something. This is why I like uh, these versus little things, and I've been watching, especially on the ones on the big level. Because hey man, they're trying for track, man. They're trying for track. I'm trying to, I'm trying to copyright this shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm gonna say, uh, I think, I think that's so much important as artists when you have these things. It be music placement, right? Because like, check this out. Like when you know the song that's gonna play next on my end. And so I got songs that go very well against what she just put this up. Whereas this is going to be a little bit more uh, uh, on the, I don't know I don't want what you want to say with this, but y'all see, but I like how you can have like everything is about placement. Cause I thought it was the same way with a different uh, verses I've seen where I was like, yep. oh, this artist would have killed this artist, but it depends on where yep. you put this song at. I, yep. that's why I, look, I think this is so dope that like we have two different like we artists and we kind of similar but we also different a lot because I will go for melodic and try to go to the mainstream and then we got like I said I gave the point for the guttleness I like that the rawness of the last yeah. one and I just was like I just appreciate how we going like the placement is playing a big part for me like knowing what yeah. I got coming up next so you know that's I just dope. think it's dope like that's crazy because like these yeah. don't even match yep. you would have thought you would have thought this song would have went with the one you played last one so it's like it's just crazy like that's we're going to play I don't even talk too much I don't want to make <laughs> no, no, you, you make, you're making a good point man no, yeah, you are, definitely you're making a good point I just that's thought it was just so dope it's, I just it's, it the, so dope. it's the art behind the you know the competition and shit man oh yeah oh yeah oh uh, this this meant um Metro Paturity are when we creep. Still a dope record, man. Oh, no question. Oh, no question. Like I said, that Ed Lavish have done a lot for me, even though they old. They have done a lot for me. That's why I placed them now. I'll be right back. Somebody fan is loud. She, she get geek, yeah. You thought she was wild for the night, not for the week, bruh. Ain't shit for free, you gotta pay for your beat, bruh. Uh, right after bands, uh, I got the dead, the Glock in my hand, the Glock in my hand, where they stand. Uh, never in least, so God, you brand. I'm flipping these pots and these pants. Uh, Rubbing the kitchen and cooking them bands. Popping outside and pushing the grounds. I'm at the bar, pushing these hands. Walking the club, like I'm the man. Running your spot, finessing your mess. Nah, no, funny, I want some chains. I want the guns, I want the stash. I want the rain.
That was a dope song. I liked it. Um, I think it was very cinematic. Like, your shit just sound like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's just some background uh, music to, like, a... Um, the power of some shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, power and shit. Like, on the real, Empire or some shit. Yeah. I mean, yeah, that shit dope. Yeah. And oh, I like the yeah, breaks yeah. down, too. Oh, shout out to uh, Dorigo Rico, man. He featured on that song, man. He killed him. Oh, yeah, the feature was nice. I was going to say that, too. Yeah, I definitely feature, was going to say that. He came through and did what he's supposed to do. Yeah, he definitely came through, for sure. Definitely. Oh, mm. What you got, Hershey? Uh, I like both of the songs a lot. It's hard. It's hard. Yeah, I like both of them. I think that um, the first one, I liked how she was talking about her queen. She was talking about her, like that was really I liked it. I just like Chuck and she ratchet little kid to be honest. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. For sure, we'll try it. Oh, for sure. And then Mexico, like yo, like right now I listen to it. I was like low key song, like uh, like it gave me amigos vibes. I, I should have put some of my stripper songs on there for you. I ain't. That would have been dope, too. No, no, no. I mean, all your songs so far have been slapping. Like, the beats go hard. No, but I should have did that, though. I forgot you was going to be on here. <laughs> 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 I would have put it right over the top. I really enjoyed listening to both of those songs. I, I really all right. So, so I, I gave this one a check. I gave this one a check because. I did, the, too. The lyrics, again, came through, said some crazy shit in the lyrics. <laughs> so I had it. I had to drop, drop that one off right there. But, um, yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, her lyrics lyric. is on point. She was yeah, like, they keep throwing crazy, shade, man. I keep getting paid. Hell yeah. <laughs> That's dope. Yeah, I, I oh, kiss my. that shit, bitch. Yeah. And I yeah. Still paid. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'll give y'all, give y'all the flow, man. T. James on so soon. I get the chat, man. I was top on that one. Yeah. What you got, Song? I gave that to Chad as well. Yeah. yeah. Me too. Oh, so we, man, here we go. Uh, turn on me. Uh, well, I mean, me yeah, turn on me. I mean, I got to look this shit up. I was in here talking with y'all. <laughs> oh, I was saying that, uh, that estate, eight and nine, that's a classic, man, uh, project to me. Fantastic. Yeah. Um, I
People call my friends and they turned on me. I have family playing, they love me and they turned on me. But what I learned, homie, this is what I learned, homie. All I got is me and I never ever turned on me. I have people call my friends and they turned on me. I have family playing, they love me and they turned on me. But what I learned, homie, this is what I learned, homie. All I got is me and I never ever turned on me. All right, you got in your bag. You heard me. Huh? Also, you got in your bag right there. Yeah, man. Hey, that was really hard. Yeah. It's it's some, it's that was some real shit, though. You yeah. was, uh, you had a lot of shit on your chest that you just got off, and it was relatable because, you know, you know, as artists, especially, you know, sometimes your family and your friends don't see the bigger picture of the shit that you're trying to do. And you just got to keep going. So great job on the concept of the song. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate that. Yeah, I felt it when she said all I got is me. I was like, yeah. Can't turn on yourself now. It's some niggas Can't that do turn on, turn on themselves. <laughs> Where I come from, man, that shit dead. <laughs> not right. turn on yourself. All right. So we got Meg coming up with By Myself. I'm this shit cold. I better be by myself. Never need no help from no one else. I better be by myself. Never need no help from no one.
I don't know, man. <laughs> it's shit crazy. I ain't oh, gonna lie. Now I, I, bro- laugh. I broke even on that one. Huh? Yeah, I did. I broke <laughs> even on that one. That's loud. They both. They both was good songs. They obviously were about going through storms and yeah, but they, they both was like kind of like the same. I can't pick on that one. They mm. even. I eat, I give it an even vote on that one. I'm telling you, man, that's that's probably fair, man. <laughs> I'm gonna fair. go with Chastity though. I like me. I'm gonna tell you. I'm about to say, I'm tell you the truth. I went with Met only because Chat Chat went personal on her. So I didn't know. If you could go more personal than Chad did, and then was like, Man was like, I'm, I'm so angry, I'm so mad. You know what I'm saying? He, he, he kind of went another level on, on the personality. Uh, that's why I picked I know why I don't know what I'm looking at. Yeah, that's why I picked her. 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 Yeah, of the four rounds so far, had the was the best pair, and so it made it a tough decision. So for me, we'll put it over the top because I like my Mets beat better, but they both were in the same lane, and um and so I, I, I like they both went to, into that personal bag, that real shit, and um we'll put it over the top for me was the beat on that one. Yeah, but but man, y'all need videos for both of them songs, man. <laughs> yeah, that that gave me like a direct song vibe. I like that. that was good. I got one for turn on me. You got one for turn on me. I mm-hmm. thought I yeah yeah. It's met then. It's met. I seen you. I ain't got. I ain't got one. I ain't got nothing from off the album. They coming. Okay. Uh, Miss Hip Hop, you, you said anything about it? I'm trying to see where that feedback is coming from, yo. Um, yeah. because if it's me, I I certainly apologize. Answer. I just, Seriously. I just, I just all uh, counted out my Facebook, so I, I'm watching it live. I ain't know it was in my phone or not. Oh, because this is a great show. I love the music, but I was just gonna say both of you guys did a magnificent job. They both dope songs. You know what I'm saying? And I, I only reason why I went with Chastity, uh, uh, Lindsay Chastity, is because it was more relatable for me. Um, Metro, you were more talking about losing people in your life like close people you lost family members in the same week that shit is deep you feel me and it's some deep people out there and i haven't reached that level of deepness but i feel you though you know but i i, I went with chastity because it's more relatable about people turning on you and yada 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 so but kudos to both of y'all yeah. great artist man great artist uh so what you got i told you mine <laughs> Oh, <laughs> well, shit. Let me uh, let me go on and queue up the other ones then. Let me see. Now y'all emailed me these other ones, so I gotta go back to my email and um, pull out. Um, I just want to say to so soon, like you um, you started some of this shit. You know what I'm saying? You know, on your lives, you do on Instagram when you're talking about people's songs and the categories and the phases and shit. I don't know what you're talking about. That's not me. Nah, but <laughs> <laughs> nah, I give thanks. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Yeah, so it, it only makes sense that you're here to judge, too, and to participate because your music is the shit, too. Thank you. I, I mean, I can't I can't give but so much credit without shouting out my co-host, uh, who actually came up with the idea. We, um, we do a show called The Framework on Instagram live. We we're in between seasons right now, but we, we ran for like 30 something weeks straight every yeah. Friday. Amazing. Um, doing like doing doing uh talk to do man. Talking about hip hop, but yeah. talking about like music that's like from weeks, that's a the era before us. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that was a lot of commitment, trust me. So yeah. but I appreciate you listening to hip for real. For sure, for sure. Keep it up for real, for real. Cause you growing yeah, like crazy. We um, cooking, so- we cooking for twenty twenty one. I promise you that. Yeah, y'all are. So this this last round, I think like these are exclusive <laughs> songs, right? Just the way it played out. Like uh Muscle yeah. That Muscle Up ain't even out right now, right? Yeah, it's not. Okay, so we're going muscle exactly. up right now. I can see the rough. You got the rough mix. Shout out to right. my beef on this on this beat. You already know. I had to go with the home team for this one. All right, here we go. Business over bitchness. You 
you can't be scared when it's time to muscle up I got brothers in the trap, about to run it up Little homie in his eyes and said you done a what? Yeah, we came from the bottom, so all we know is up Hard times never stopped us, we some wild ones If we feel threatened, we gon' pop some Shorty real bad, so you know she bout some And I ain't even got an ass, so she down a what? I got hitters that really live in the cut One phone call, I had your ass sliced up Across the market, I never miss, always on park it Yeah, they thought I was finished, but I ain't start my mark yet Still on your head like they mark ya Yeah, I'm somewhere lost in the cloud, bout to spark ya We ain't worried about who bitch made All we care about is getting paid I do what I gotta do to make a way, yeah And muscle love. when it's time to roll Well, you muscle love. muscle love. Muscle up, shit, when it's time to go, will you muscle up? Muscle up, muscle up, when it's time to roll, will you muscle up? Muscle up, muscle up, shit, when it's time to roll, will you muscle up? Muscle up, I was down bad on my ass, yeah, 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 yeah. Had to go and get it all in my bag, yeah, 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 yeah. Stop until I get to the top, nigga. Me and my homies, we gon' always count the figures. We ain't stopping till we get to the top, little nigga. Me and my homies, we gon' really count them figures. And it ain't no limit when you muscle up. We ain't got no role model, so we doing us. Went from posting up the stove to living plush. And won't trust no niggas, all we trust is us. Beep, beep, no more hoop these to the new G. Ratchet bras to the queen freak. Living life cause it's free. And I can't worry about y'all cause I'ma do me. From the projects to the hills, then I made my movie. Then I muscle up. Shit, when it's time to roll, will you muscle up? Yeah, muscle up. Muscle up, shit, when it's time to go, will you muscle up? Shit, muscle up, muscle up, when it's time to roll, will you muscle up? Muscle up, muscle up, shit, when it's time to go, will you muscle up? Muscle up. Business over bitchness, make sure you go get that, nigga. Yo, I just, I want to say something. I, I've, I've been sitting and not being the first one to speak after songs, but I want to say two quick, very important things. When we did the show last week and Matt was telling me how he took the time to really listen to my music prior to the show, I was really appreciative. And then um, I was already planning on going ahead and listening to his music, but then knowing that we was all going to be in this same uh, situation was even more like, okay, let me see what he fucking with. And your shit is fire, bro. That being said, I don't know what you got lined up for this, but that was the best song of this entire round. I don't even know that I have anything in my lineup for that, honestly. No, if I had to go that, that, that shit was the perfect merge of like concept, song, beats, uh, 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 beats and a uh, beat and lyric. Excuse me. That shit was tough. Like, um, my my partner was in the back sitting here talking about her favorite gospel song. I don't know why. Tell me about that. And now I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm fucking around. But nah, nah. Like I was on, I was on the sideline trying to like, I'm like going back and forth trying to get some food because I haven't eaten all day. And um, when, when I heard that beat drop, and I was, all right, let me come up on this shit and pay the fuck attention. That that shit went hard in the motherfucking paint. Mix and match so, with that bit is hard. That is a go. That, that, that's the rough that's mix. The rough. And that's the rough. Mix and master, mix and master that bit a go. That's the rough. <laughs> <laughs> kudos, Shaq, kudos. Yeah, That's coming off the new album, so you can really see the change because the last four tracks came off Established 89, but that one is off the new album, you feel me? So you really can see the growth. You really can. I'm lost in Mikey lines again. Yeah, I, know, hey, look, I, look, I ain't got no shame in, in that. I ain't got no shame. I ain't got a catalog. I'm good. I ain't got no shame. I know you don't. That's why I feel fine with being honest with you, I'm man. Good. I'm good. I'm good. I, like hey, hey, I, I got. I got to drop. I got to drop mid shit. This this the round I didn't even want to uh, judge right here, but I'm. Gonna <laughs> no, I really like that song. I ain't gonna hold you because, like I said. Yeah. Mr. I'll tell you, Matt Matt Ma got some fire right here, man. He gonna sign it, man. Fine. He fine as hell now. Let's see this fine. Compliments. And I don't need no damn words to boost my confidence I never knew that all this toxic shit would come with this I like it better when you didn't know I that I exist one day Maybe on Sunday I was hoping you freed me, no this ain't easy I know you down sometimes, I know you need I'd rather 
had to be alone I can feel all this shit, I wasn't made of stone They can't take back all the times and then they did me wrong Get my life into this world and now they turn me cold And it's hard, man I'm doing, doing favors, I'm so heartless I was good all the way, that's regardless What was love was this when we were starving? We didn't came a long way for the ramen, yeah Remember we was in the projects Now we doing real good, we making progress I'm living real good, we living flawless I'm about to win the Grammy, take it to the party. These bitches killing me out, I hope they fucking learn they lesson Just throw another ball and I'ma toss it off my shoulders Two little girls around and I can't wait till they get older I'ma show them how real men take care of their women We got some standards, yeah we independent To all of my brothers, look how we did it They say we was mud bound, mama we did it Only on a Sunday And the problems like around on a Monday Bills trying to get you down, we on a fundraiser straight to metro now both songs was tight chastity i like your shit because it was like a nighttime vibe you know you're gonna muscle up you're gonna do it you know what i'm saying we going what it's like a nighttime riding song but metro i really like your style um i i, I keep seeing that you gonna you gonna you gonna be going play i mean everybody's going places but your shit is tight though it's real it's real. It, it gave me peaceful vibes. It gave me Sunday vibes, like I just need some peace, like blessings and shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Big facts. Big facts. Yeah. What, what Hold on. What you got? What you got, Big T James? Man, come on now. That was a crazy round. Hey, where you from, bro? Right. <laughs> but I like that. I like that you had to ask me that question. That's why I do what me I do. Me too. I'm from Birmingham. I'm right. I'm okay. Right. Oh, that's dope. Right you you right up the street, but yeah. I, oh, okay. he he won that one. I gotta get out yeah, with him on that. Me too. You know what sure. when, when the beat, I like, like oh. Yeah, because I was like, okay. <laughs> bro, got some, bro got like some real energy. I think I myself just like chilling, listening to that song. Like, like uh, Miss Hip Hop said, like, it's a vibe song. Like, you know, laying down, smoking, just listening to this. That maybe on Sunday we really did it. Yeah, G. Maybe on Sunday. It fun. felt like Sunday when I was listening to that oh, song. Wow. Oh, crazy. <laughs> Big fat. Yeah. Man, I'm just glad. I'm just glad they was able to participate and get that type of battle, man. I mean, hey, it's so it's, dope that we the, both of those songs not even out. So I just like for me to her, like I appreciate that, like we was able to do something like that, like yeah, we, yeah, no, I going. appreciate you for yeah. real. Yeah, for sure. We definitely gonna tap in. So about for sure. up and building, man, building up, man, for real. Oh, yeah. Yo, I, listen, listen. I'm I'm going I'm going with with T James did last round. I can't. I'm sitting here listening to y'all trying to see if anything that anybody is saying is gonna sway me one way or another. But and and let me tell you, Matt. Let me tell you why that song is important. Let me tell you why you as an artist are important because on the when we did um just chilling podcast last week and and Matt you were part of it as a uh, co-host. I, I I told y'all I'm I'm a little older, you know what I'm saying. So I'm from a different era, and I'm not on this old head shit. But I don't listen to a lot of music from current artists, right? It's, it's a different vibe for me, and I'm not knocking it. I'm not hating on it. Nothing like that. I just don't listen to it as much as stuff that comes from 
I guess people who sound like with the era that I'm coming from. Right. And so one, you've given me an appreciation for music from your era. And that song, man, I, I, and I said to, I said to you specifically after chat song, like you, you, I don't know how it's head, but you better come with some shit because that record, chat's record was tough, and you came with it. I, I don't have an answer for this one. That choir and what you and did on that hook and how you layered the hook on the second chorus with the ad libs. Yeah. Whoo, that like I'm getting chills just talking about it right now, like. I, I can't, I, if I must give a vote for the sake of tiebreaker, I will, but I don't know if we're at that point. Like, that's that round was kudos to both of y'all. Like, that, both of them records, like, had me, my partner was in the background. She was knocking her head to both songs, like, for real. That's what's so, my round right there. Tough. tough. Hey, look, look, both did, I, I made my list and I sent them to him. And so, yeah. he, he didn't do this. So, I'm assuming that she do, did the same. So that's, that's what I'm saying. I think I'm I'm I, I'm assuming we all did the same. So yeah. the way, particularly those last two rounds matched up for y'all, yeah. But that's this crazy. one for me, I can't. I know T. James was like he gave it to you, Matt, but I'm I'm doing what he did in round four. I, I can't say which one won this one because these <laughs> those records were fucking I like I need those shit to my catalog asap. Like real shit. And I'll be cheerleading from New York on social media, like listen to these motherfuckers, like real. <laughs> shit. What about? Sure. Sure. No, and, hey, pleasure to uh, meet you, Chad. And I, it's and nice. It's right. a pleasure, fam, for, for real. Hell yeah. yeah. All right, Chad, and all uh, met. I appreciate y'all opening up the trap of track on some on some beast mode shit. But y'all can kind of sit back now and play judge, man, because now we got so soon and uh, T James coming up. Uh, right, Hershey, if you will, uh, flip the coin and find out where we're going first. Hands. We all love hands. Who called hands? Me? Yo, yo, before before the coin is flipped, let me tell you how I have this hater right over my shoulder. My girlfriend, she texts me. So listen, listen, I live in a building and my girlfriend's mom lives only a few floors below us. And she texted me like 30 minutes ago before she came back in the apartment. Like, um, good luck. If you lose, you're sleeping on the couch. <laughs> so and so like where I'm standing right now, I'm standing in our kitchen and the couch is behind my laptop. And she right when, when Miguel was like, oh, wait, uh, flip the coin. Um, she goes, she's sitting here gesturing to me. Here's the couch, motherfucker. You about to yo. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> it be like that sometimes. It be like that, bro. It do. Y'all <laughs> want it? Who want? Who want a head? Who want first? Run. I take the heads. Tails one. Tails one. All mm -hmm. right. So we're going with uh, we're going with creative. Let me find it. I just like how y'all shit pop right up when I search it. What's up? Creator, y'all. Welcome to Queens, the F train to E, the N, M, to R, the A, J, to Z, the 7 train to C, the Mets, Q, and the G, the party is by me, the firm Kennedy, my borough is deep, my borough unique, West Indians East, Indians and Sikhs, Black Latinos and Greeks, Asians who reap, all black Jews got that jewelry cheap, you play the streets, I play for keeps, you play with your me, you playing with beef, I play for peace, I came to eat, don't bite the hand, that made the feast, here's the recipe, for the best cuisine, a tablespoon of soon, Todd bless the beat, collectively, top chef in the manifest destiny, I'm a creator. <laughs> Yo, 
Come check the scene. It's far-fetched you see. Any rooks or vets. Ever step to me. I'm not threatening. My rep is clean. It's just something that says. Don't mess with me. I catch wreck with these. My pen it bleeds. Turn your chest to a messy debris. So fresh stand next to me. Still wouldn't catch a cold in a text when I F and sneeze. Kind that keeps sweating me. For my energy. They enemies. Hope flex is free. Please drop a bomb. Like an F-16. May I rest in peace. Ever toss soon been the heat. Test my pee full of fresh weed and electricity. Electricity. More than enough for a city that never sleeps. Kansas gonna get me I, 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 I'm a creator. <laughs> Yo, New York is back. I hate saying that, but I'm saying that we ain't playing Jack. Toy Store Jack, Nick Patrick say Jack. Jack Black, Jack White, I don't give a Jack shit. You Jack rip my whack shit. Call me Jack, come in. I spit hat tricks, hits back to back. You come back in a black DeLorean. Matter of fact, got more chicks than Jack Trip and a mattress. They practice, they ad lib like. Nah, this ain't madness, madness is Marshall Mathers at a Christmas pageant Ha, I don't even know what crack is When a clash with a Titan best release the Kraken The bandwagon is equipped with magnets Even in the North Pole, my shit's attractive Kansas is gonna get me more I, 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 I'm a creator what you are I'm a creator So look, we got kicked out of Facebook, but I'm gonna um, I'm gonna play this round out, and then we're gonna jump back on Facebook after this round. Cool. It'll be the secret rounds that nobody knows about. Right, right. <laughs> cool. Well, on YouTube, they will. It's still recording though. Yeah, oh, it's shit. Like, it's gonna be a babe on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Don't get the wilding on here, showing on uh, getting naked and stuff. Don't do that. <laughs> All right, we got TJ in with Street. Now, the thing about it is, um. Let me see. I gotta gotta look up streets on YouTube. Uh, it might come with a little uh, what you call it, advertising, but whatever. I try to skip it as soon as I can. You <laughs> know, as you're looking for it, I just want to say I took a I took the moment to listen to uh, everybody. Oh, oh, oh. My mama told me I can be whatever I wanna be. I could have been a doctor, lawyer, but I told the streets. Yeah, I told the screen. I could have been a pro baller, but I told the screen. My, my mama told me I could be whatever I wanna be. I could have been a doctor, lawyer, but I told the screen. Screen, screen, screen. Yeah, I told the screen. I should have took my ass to school, but I told the screen. Hey, 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 I'm just trying to stack that paper all like money made. You know. It's winter time, but my block hot as the month of May. I've been fucking your little bitch going on a month a day. He say whatever that I buy, he gon' front the weight. Wait, wait. I'm just smoking like a freight train. She say I'm shining on these niggas, call me eight chains. I fuck with big dogs, St. Bernard's and Great Dames. I ain't a psychic, but I see me doing great things. Hey, pull up with that work, nigga, time to eat. Just got a call, say my dog got caught in the sweet. Damn. Nigga snitching shit then got deep Nigga folding under pressure, no, not me When it come to these songs, boy, I'm speaking facts If I'm chopping it up with jizzle, no, we speaking packs Racks, busting all out my damn jeans My auntie said, boy, go ahead, do the damn thing My, my mama told me I can be whatever I wanna be I could've been a doctor, lawyer, but I told the streets Streets yeah, I told the street I could've been a pro baller, but I told the street M My mama told me I could be whatever I wanna be I could've been a doctor, lawyer, but I told the street Street, street Yeah, I told the street I should've took my ass to school, but I told the street hey, yo, 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 bitch, 
understand, cause I'm fly than a UFO. A young nigga flipping packs, I turn two to four. I turn four to eight, stupid, stupid, loaded safe. We in the basement, busting bows down with the loaded case. Ayy, I came from dirt like the Flintstones. Your girl say I make a wet without it being gone. We pack that whole back and forth like ping pong. All these blunt back to back got me chain chong. I'm on next, be my check, call me King Kong. Many niggas getting jammed and they sing songs. I just want the money, nigga, put my team on. We just want the championship, put our rings on. What the fuck, goddamn, all the lean gone. My partner died behind the wheel, now his dream gone. I just wanna thank God I seen another year. Now why me turn up on these niggas in that Gucci gear? My, my mama told me I can be whatever I wanna be. I could've been a doctor, lawyer, but I told the street, street, street. Yeah, I told the street. I could've been a pro baller, but I told the street. My, my mama told me I could be whatever I wanna be. I could've been a doctor, lawyer, but I told the streets, street, street. Yeah, I told the streets. I should've took my ass to school, but I told the streets. Jane, what was it like uh, recording that uh, video? Uh, Carm Banks. What was it like recording that video? Oh, man, it was love, man. That was my first video ever, man. I didn't think it was even going to be that deep. Yeah, you ran deep in that video. I was I was watching that earlier today. You you yeah, I was deep up in that shit. That's my first ever video, man. I, I couldn't believe that many people came. Mm-hmm. That's dope. That really true. Yeah. Oh, nah, you you had man and Chad, y'all in the judge seat now, man. What's up now? Oh yeah, I'm wait, I was waiting on my turn. Uh, yeah. <laughs> me too. <laughs> me too, man. You on me, me too. You on me now? I go. All right. We on me now? Cause I, yeah. I I'm ready. Yeah, you got it. All right, cool. All right, so exactly. I'm, get, I'm I'm getting the point. I'm giving the point to T. James, but and you know, you know, number one, your your music sounds so. It sounds, you go to a studio, you have to, because your shit sounds so much better than mine coming out of this damn thing. I do everything myself, so I appreciate the quality of what you brought. However, I'm not gonna only just give you your roses, I gotta get so soon his roses too, because I feel like as a person, especially from the South, a lot of your songs, especially because I know that Miguel gonna share this and I've shared this, a lot of people not gonna appreciate what was done on that song. And for me, I know I know that song created very well and I fucking love that song. So to hear what you did with that sample and put that together and made your song, I think you did something so fucking dope right there. And that song is hard as fuck. And I don't think that a lot of people that's outside of the realm of New York or just the you know Northern period is gonna appreciate what you just did. And so that song was fucking hard as hell too. Now we know he got the jiggy and the bounce that came with it, but that, <laughs> that shit duh, that shit duh is something to be, you know, reckoned to. I can't, I come from really, I know y'all be hearing me singing and you know, that, that's just my Southern influence, but my, the heart, the core, the, the, you know, who I am in my soul, even though I came from the church background, I really was a real rapper, like for real, for real. And I was bar, barring niggas up. And so I appreciate what you did on the neck. That's why I came, that's why. So I appreciate what you did too. I want you to get some roses on that one too. Oh, but we, man. I mean, with that sound, it's gonna be very fucking hard to compete with. You know, that's you know, yeah. that's today's sound. And not only yeah. that, you did a magnificent job of whoever engineered your shit because like you even had me sitting here like, God damn, I wish my shit sounded good. That shit sounded really good. But so soon you're gonna get your roses from me too, because I appreciate that. All right. Um, I just wanna let everybody know we back live on Facebook. So if y'all wanna go in I and share the share the uh share the video y'all can now so we can get some mm -hmm. running. Oh yeah, videos. let me reshare. Thank you. Yeah, let me reshare. <laughs> I wouldn't even yeah. I think they only gonna let us run like an hour at a time, but I don't give a fuck, we be back. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I was just gonna say both songs was dope as hell to me. Um so soon. I I'm just gonna be very honest. I'm just give it to so soon because it literally like took me like a trip through New York. Like I was walking through on the streets, you know what I'm saying? Like I could 
hear and smell and breathe New York. And and that's like very rare to pick up in a song, you know, and that's why I'm giving it to him because you are the creator of your own universe. So kudos on the concept and everything. T. James, your song was fucking fire too because first of all, your um, Southern accent or whatever, that shit was dope as fuck. It, it just go like, yeah, I can't do it, but it's dope when you do it, okay? <laughs> I fucking love it. It reminded me of like T.I. or something. And no, you don't sound like T.I., but I'm saying that Southern vibe is the shit, you know? And it was it had that bounce to it. Like, yeah, you know, right. when I'm on that level, for sure. But like I said, I give this point to So Soon. Right. I'll I come on next. I'm going to give it I'm gonna give it to T.J. Only because I feel like he's speaking. That's why I call him Big T.J. I feel like he's speaking to a certain community of people that grew up like we grew up and he, you grew up having people tell you what you can do and what you can do but you also mm -hmm. got streets over here lurking and looking at you as well so we need you to do this as well he portrayed that in a beautiful fashion i seen that growing up in my life so i had to give it to him because it, it that's a classic song that i always go back to uh just on a personal level but respect oh hold on hold on, hold on. i know y'all waiting on so soon bros too but he he got that Kanye West vibe, man. I think you had a, a Kanye West vibe, uh, a line in there. Um, yeah, man, just that Lupe Fiasco, man. That's what came. Lupe up. Fiasco, that beat is that's tough. What came up to me so soon, to it, that's yeah. a tough beat to flow over. Period. True, that's man. like a robotic beat. Fuck with that beat. That, that beat, beat is definitely oh going God. crazy. Yeah. Man, you gotta know it to know it. That's that's the shit, man. I'm sorry. That's the Matt, shit. Matt, I appreciate you knowing that Santi Gold, cause yeah, yeah, when 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 the producer gave me the beat, I was like, what the fuck? And I and I had just started getting into music, but I just wanted to say that, like, Matt, you made a good point that like it's 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 interesting being in this situation because. I'm the only East Coast person in this entire situation. Everybody's either Midwest or South right now. And I'm getting education right now. And, and so I, what I'm realizing is that, and what I was realizing as I was preparing to go against T. James is that my very distinct New York sound could work for me or against me depending on who's listening and who's making the decision. And I can live with that. I can live yeah. with that because I'm not trying to sound like something I'm no. not. Right. But, you know, like T. James got a sound that is very much his and I, I fuck with it. So when I was listening, I was like, fuck, I need to like, you know, yeah. gear up. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's, like, it's not going to be no, you know. Uh, Hershey, what you got? Um, Where's T. James from again? Uh, he from Alabama. Gaston. Oh, okay. Okay. Definitely could hear it. Um, she said definitely can hear it. Now, this is the same time you made him leave. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> he out. He probably got to charge his phone real quick or something. He'll be back. No, he back but, in. He back in. Um, so soon, your wordplay was lit. Like, yep, yep. I don't think I wasn't listening to that wordplay. That shit was lit as well. And then we said something about <laughs> And I was like, okay, 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 okay. Um, and T. James, well, I'm from the South, so your song was really good. So I think that I'm going to go with T. James just because, like, I like the lyrics. I like the song in general. But you went crazy. I'm writing on front. And I was in here listening. Damn, you was fun. Wait, that was good. Thank you. Yo, you know, I'm going to go with the home team just because not only, you know, it's the home team, but T, T. James' song, The Streets, is like one of my favorite songs from him because it is so relatable. You know, where we come from, that situation is real. Knowing T. James, he, he ain't speaking no flaw, fake cap shit. That's all real facts. Um, So soon, man, he's incredible. Like, you you like you know hip-hop, you know this is the New York artist. And his lyrics, the beat, I was like, oh, my God. Like, it was so much going on. Like, fuck that shit cold. Like, bro, it's cold, you know. But my point going with T. James with the streets because I can relate to the song. Respect. Respect. <clears throat> All right, so we're going with Animated from uh, So Soon. I got the track list ready. Like soon to follow your Twitter Batman, Catwoman, rivalry, bitter But baby, you the shit I wanna clean your litter Playhouse, 
Just Mrs. and Mr. Witcher. On second thought, if this sitter is legal, maybe we can reconsider. She claimed brittle, so I better told her she gon' fuck around and get a tree trunk in her. Her face fell, her ass went on a shape like that. Yeah, baby, got that. She's animated, goddamn, I am. On a light. You remind me of a song I was gonna write. She saw the scarf in the dress code. You're alike and said, You don't look like the performance type. I responded, like, ha, You're right. I don't perform, I transform when I'm on the mic. Facial expression kind of sort of like she wanna fight. I threw the lunch, she took the bait, I caught a bite. We gon' get it on tonight. All of the lights on a pearly white. Oh, she got right. a smile like, Ow. and she walked like, Ow. and I ask her, What? Yeah, baby, got it back. Yo, that beat was fucking crazy. Oh, that God. shit, that brassy ass tone, that comic book superhero, yeah, I'm lit crazy. transformer, give me the blunt nigga shit. Like, I love that. <laughs> no, I'm serious. That shit was dope. So I'm bugging out because I'm misperforming in, in, in like real time. So I'm just like bugging out. Like, that's my favorite oh, song to perform. Damn. Oh, yeah. We might as well play the whole round now, man. That shit ain't fair. Let me no, let me go on and drop all my shit. I'm back on my shit and you little nigga hating. Get him some panties, he act like a lady. I snapped out the rook, man, I feel like the baby. But I'm T.J. the GOAT, the greatest. I'm staying in the wheel while I'm rolling the press. Cut out my old the new one with less. I'm in the trap on my beast for Nelson. I get that he got these streak all this Elsa. Calling it Elsa, you know these niggas gon' fall like a press. She know she fucking, I'm gone on my next. Some me so good, man, I thought I was special. I know these niggas gon' fall on the press. They know I'm getting to that cheat like Chelsea. I'm in the trap with them P, no vessel. I want them M's and nothing less. I want them millions, nothing lesser. I want that Bentley skirt on the line. All these hoes be acting boozy, but down low, all these hoes be thighs. Broke 
that nigga tryna wipe my pocket. Oh, All the blue honey make a nigga feel cocky. Oh, this is your bitch, man, a nigga got options. Got How you gon' stop this? How you gon' top this? Nigga get money all day like Monopoly. Yeah. All you lame broke ass nigga do it gossip. Yeah. You an imposter, yeah. drippin' like pasta. Yeah. Just add a little bad little bitch to my roster. These yeah. nigga actin' they gon' get an Oscar. Uh -oh. Fuck with you man, you know that we poppin'. Uh -oh. She tryna rip me straight out of my breeze. I'm about to fuck her and get a little key. I be yeah. using her Addy in less than a week. She be What's callin' me Zaddy, your bitch a little freak. I'm having plates on plates, I'm eating. I'm making play after play, no CAP. These niggas CAT. I can't go nowhere without that scrap on me. Ops in the blitz tryna tackle me. Put cash tryna face to a masterpiece. Got the game on lock, got the master key. No limit to the shit like Master P. These niggas master spinner. You not with the gang, can't hang with me. I came from the trenches, that thing with me. If I ain't by myself, then the gang with me. If I ain't by myself, then the gang with me. 2020 on a nigga that came to see. Let go. Hey, I'm back on my shit and you little nigga hating. Get him some panties, he act like a lady. I snapped out the rip, man, I feel like the baby. But I'm TJ, the GOAT, the greatest. I'm staying the wheel while I'm rolling the pressure. Cut out my old blood, a new one with Lessa. I'm in the trap, I'm on beats of Vanessa. I get that heat, cut these streak all this Elsa. Holder than Elsa, you know these niggas gon' fall like a brussel. She know she fucking, I'm gone on my necks. Something so good, man, I thought I was special. I know these niggas gon' fall on the press. They know I'm getting to that cheese like Chelsea. I'm in the trap with them P, no Velsa. I want them M's and nothing less. 2020, nigga, it's up there. It's stuck there. Real rap shit, nigga. Let go, let go, let go, let go. Okay. That was high. That was good. That was what's up. Yeah. I feel I like, like this is a tough one to judge right here. This is a tough one. Yeah. It's definitely it a tough one. Because I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, we'll get it. Okay. I was lit. And then though, but so soon lyrics on the animated went so Yes, hard. my God. It went so hard. Like again, that whole him talking about if they're so well together like that, I like that. Yeah. And T. James, I think you could like do like a collaboration with Megan Thee Stallion for that joint. Oh, like, I was just saying, like, it was popping though. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? What you got, man? Um, me, um, my point on some spoons, but let me tell you something. Uh, and, th and that's because I'm going with so soon for me personally over um just the whole uh creativity of what it, of that song. Real talk. Real talk. Um, real dope. Um, creative. I love that type of shit. And you know, when we have New York artists like that, you know, like I said, you also gotta appreciate what they bring, and I appreciate that because that's the type of shit I like. However, T. James. Dude, I swear for God, you have like one of the best voices. Like when we talk about just <laughs> like listening to your nah. voice rapping, like sometimes yeah. rapping, I know myself listening to me, but I like listening to myself. But like when we just listening to you rapping, like I can listen to you rap like all day. Like your voice yeah. is like, that good. Like just it's listening so to you. the delivery is hard. The hard I did, I'm only going with his song because to me, it stood out a little bit more on the creative yeah. side. It's like, yeah. mm, what, what is, like if I was walking by, I'd be like, what the fuck? Is, like, okay, let me listen to this. Or, okay, what he got going yeah, on? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that yeah, shit was yeah. mad creative. But like, just listen to your voice. I'm looking up. I'm like, damn, like his voice sounds really, really fucking good. Like, but I, I do give my point to so soon on this round though. But I gave you yeah. my first one. So, but but for sure, like that shit was hard though. Both of y'all, that was good. I like that. Appreciate, it. appreciate. It. Chad, what we got? For sure. So soon. Man, man. This one was hard for me because I like both of the songs. So soon, shit, man. It's, it, it's still ringing in my head. Yeah. You know, she animated that shit. I see the visual. Like, I hope you got on a Superman cape somewhere. Flying, <laughs> flying around. Like, you feel me? For real. Like, and I like that animated shit. I definitely got to give my point to the animated game because, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm a big nerd, mm -hmm. but niggas don't know that because I'm from the hood. <laughs> but that shit is and it's still ringing in my head. T James, oh my shit, it's my. Sh I'm a hood nigga. You feel me? Like y'all, yeah. T James got that voice. His delivery is always on point. He know, he know, he cold in my book. Killing it, killing it. Yeah, that song was real. I was listening to it. I was like, yeah, that's definitely something I'll bring to the club. And then, but so soon that those lyrics, man, they went so hard. Like a vibe song. Like that's another vibe song. Actually, I like it a lot. All right, we're going on. We're going on uh, TJ straight out of Bama. Let me see. Yeah, yeah. Top. I need to 
So far, T. James, I still got a chance to sleep in my bed and out on the motherfucking couch. So far. We want one right now. <laughs> my girlfriend is ten, less than 10 feet away from me, just like looking on the Facebook Live on her phone. And I'm just sitting here like, I hope I get the bed. I hope I get the bed. That, is that a little sweat right about your head? Right about your forehead? I think that's, that's cause I'm wearing this sweatshirt. I'm trying to promote my brand. This is my shirt. This is my my apparel line. So I'm wearing this sweatshirt in a hot ass apartment when I see hey, being hey, in a look, t-shirt. Look, that's, fame, that's, look, that's fame, what I'm look, saying. I just got on sweatpants on here. Look, I just like I look like a rapper. I look like a rapper from the head to the top. That's what I like. I'm I got ball shorts on, but I got this sweatshirt on just in case anybody sees it and fucks with this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel it. I feel it. I feel it. All right, we're going, we're going straight out of Bama, T. James. This shit hard. This shit hard. Straight up out of Bama with this shit, nigga. Yeah, we straight up out of Bama with this shit. Straight up out of Bama, I ain't never had shit. Took a couple L's, but I swear I ain't quit. Made a lot of sales, done 12 in the bridge. Lady got me moving like a shit in the bitch. The price is high like condo. Even why I climb tail in my front door. No, no. Trouble siders keep the blunt low. Yeah. These niggas wanna leave me wet like a poncho. Hey. The way a bitch on my dick, I feel like Huncho. Huncho. She know I got the good D like Rondo. I'm, I'm, I'm a PC trapping out the condo. In the big with the heat like Alonzo. Like I, I, I had a dream, me and my team on islands and shit. Islands she pretty shit. water, we diving your bitch. Diving your bitch. <laughs> Money just piling and shit, we wildin' little bitch. Cutting don't we deserve to? Ah. I'm going in like a curfew. In, Fresh is them guys in the hearse too. Fresh. Yo bitch won't see what them purse do. <laughs> Came out of nowhere like two. Now they tell me on the shit, no manure. Straight up, I'm way dirty as a sewer. Dirty. Ain't got no friend, cause the dog, they'll do ya. I be grooving to the melody. To just a young nigga try to say he fell in I swear I used to have them whole life. Be a bell of me until I bond it to that green no celery. You know, I smoke good gas, I sell a beef. Don't have my phone for no grounds, so I'm looking for the cheese. I got bowl for the cheese, 150 for the O. Set them bitches in my sleep. Man, that shit too easy. Man, that water get deep. That water get deep. I hope you can swim. I hope you can swim. Snakes in the grass. Snakes in the grass. I peep in my sim. I ain't never wanna fuck with these niggas. I would never wanna be like these niggas. Frame too fit to make it hard to see niggas. Regardless if they hate, promise I'ma see figures. Yeah, yeah. Straight up out of Bama, I ain't never had shit. Took a couple. Ills, but I swear I didn't quit. Made a lot of sales, done 12 in the bricks. Lean got me moving like a snail in the bitch. Hit prices high like condo. Reason why I climb tail in my front door. Trouble siders keep the blunt low. These niggas wanna leave me wet like a poncho. Straight, straight, straight about a bama, this a whole new way. I'm trying to ball like I shave. I hear my people out of shade. But we worried too busy getting paid. I'm from Bama, the home of the slaves. I want crisp filled with farms and maids. They say your boy flow sick as AIDS. They know I keep loud like parade. Hey, I was in BP every day. No bells, long as I had cake. I wasn't worried about shit, bitch. I'm straight. Used to go fuck your bitch if he hate. Ha. Now I'm on a whole new level. More blue, more cheddar. Oh. Your, your, your bitch won't do what I let her. Who's I mean, do what I tell her. Yeah. Hey, get money, little nigga. Even if you working with an O. Stay down, flip that shit, get some more. Go all in, nigga, watch your money grow. Before you know it, you a have, you a foe. Then a half, then a bow. The plus he is saving what you're buying, he gon' throw. Make sure you stay low, you know. I swear the game so cut through. Partner crush your partner for the good stove. Have you ever worn work on a bus though? I seen your nigga on the ground without a bus, no. This shit get deep. Feel like I've been running from the reef. Mama keep telling me I need G. I'm on the phone with the plug. I need bass right now. Straight up out of Bama, I ain't never had shit. Took a couple L's, but I swear I didn't quit. Made a lot of sales, done 12 in the bricks. Lean got me moving like a snail in it, bitch. Hit prices high like condo. Reason why I climb tail in my front door. Trouble siders keep the blunt low. These niggas wanna leave me wet like a poncho. That's what I'm talking about. Take me to Alabama, motherfucker. Okay? <laughs> Take me there. <laughs> That's what the fuck I'm talking about. I, I, just, I want to come in because I've been trying to uh, uh, get this man his props since the jump. Because like I said, I listened to his music beforehand to you know, be able to prepare or whatever. And, and I, there's a few things I want to say real super quick. First of all, T. James, he's too cool in the live. <laughs> the kind of music he make. He's sitting there just like, yeah, you know, he ain't not into his shit. You know, he's just sitting there chilling. I'm like, you make just like music that is everything 
but just sitting here chilling. Like, cause every song I'm sitting here battling against your ass, nodding, <laughs> singing the lyrics because I listened to this shit earlier just so I knew what I was getting into. You know what I'm saying? So I just wanted to point that out first of all. Second of all, every song that you, the three songs from you so far, and you just got bars that like just yeah so I, real quick the three bars that stood out to me um in the hook uh no well yeah in the hook you said these niggas want to leave me let, wet like poncho um you had the line i think in the first verse where you said i'm going in like a curfew and then uh, the rondo line and something about giving the three, like rondo like yo and then and then you followed up with the like Lonzo, like yo and then and then uh, final, final thing, i'm a big I'm big on flow. I love flow. Yeah. And you yeah. switched flow like four times in that record. And all of it was just tight. Tight. I appreciate, I appreciate that, it, Bro, when I heard that, like, every song that you're bringing to this is, like, fire. And when I heard that song, I was like, if you play this shit, this is a problem. That. I appreciate this that, problem. bro. Real shit. I appreciate it. You're going humanizing. Uh, so so you're getting sleepy sleepy now on the count of three want you to wake one two three man, you got me in a trance and i can't understand it how a glance got a man's mind feeling enchanted with the command of a hand click she bending over to the front and her booty expanded this club is the universe these women are the planet heart pumping through my shirt but the way you're dancing i gotta put you to work part of my advances but i didn't come here to stand in i can't stand to dance i can't dance to stand can't understand why i want to dance but can't sit i'm a red-handed bandit if the chance is granted somebody's daughter's gonna be somebody's parent hypnosis your hips motion got every dude in the club to get focused i've been hoping to get close man. please don't send me away i get homesick those hips whining a hypnotizing those hips whining a hypnotizing so precise even when you're improvising so enticing when you really ain't trying those hips whining a hypnotizing Shake it all. 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 Gypsy queen, my pockets were a minty green, but now they're bald like Mr. Clean. Hell nah, she ain't getting me. You've been got like Homer J. Simpson and Krispy Kreme. Or maybe OJ Simpson. So ain't pimping. Got the ass mask like trick or treat. She's quick, she's stick up in them six jeans. Hit me with the Stedman, she was Oprah Winfrey. Right before she dipped, chick had the nerve to kiss me. Then she clicked her fingers, and I woke up dizzy. Hypnosis, your hips motion. Got every dude in the club to get focused. I've been hoping to get close, man. Please don't send me away. I get homesick. Those hips whining a hypnotizing. Those hips whining a hypnotizing. So precise, even when you're improvising. So enticing when you really ain't trying. Those hips whining a hypnotizing. Shake it all. Shake it all. Shake it all. Shake it all. Round and round she goes now. Where she stops, she'll probably go down. Roller coaster. Watch the slow down. Ride ain't over. One more go round. Out of control now. She's in control how. She get it to go wild. She hit it to show how. It dips like a snow plow. She's flipping it pro style. She's flipping it oh wow. She's spinning it pro style. She did it with no smile. She whispered in my ear, come get it, let's go now. Take you to my place. Then take me to yo now. Baby, the whole mom. Baby, it's yours now. Gave me the whole cow. Yowzers. Hypnosis. Yeah, it's motion. Got every dude in the club to get focused. I've been hoping to get close, man. Please don't send me away. I get homesick. Shake it all. Shake it all. Shake it all. Those hips whining a hypnotizing. Those hips whining a hypnotizing. So precise even when you're improvising. So enticing when you really ain't trying. Those hips whining a hypnotizing.
All right. What's on that? <laughs> there you go. Oh, okay. Well, y'all. I don't got to be the song. I got to look up T. Jane shit right quick. Oh, wait. That went. I'm not tripping. That went. You didn't play that song before? No. Nah. That was last nah. round? That was last round? Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Do we that's, the end of, that's the end of the round right there. Oh, okay. Nah, okay. You, you switched I'm it up. You switched Miguel, it up. Miguel started round three with C. James. Yeah, you started round three with me. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, okay. Okay, so that's the end of the round, though, right? Yeah, y'all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, y'all, 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 uh, crickets, man. Listen, I got this one for T. James because the word play was his own straight out of uh, Bama. Um, uh, y'all can go from there, man. I give this round to T. James too. <laughs> yeah, I like the straight out of Bama. I give it to T. James too. Yeah, is yeah. that is that song? That's when that was going. Hypnotize is fine though. Yeah, that would be hard for me to go either way. I ain't gonna lie to you. That was that's just a Bama old. I was gonna get that to him, you know. <laughs> that's a bias right there. I was biased <laughs> once before, so I think I deserve to be biased one time. <laughs> <laughs> but, but let me tell y'all what Miss what Miss Hip Hop said about um my first song creator that it took her through a trip through New York. That's what I felt about Straight Out of Bama. Like it's like it's like a it's like an anthem to the you know and a good like a good hometown anthem when it's done properly is it yeah. So I, I give it to T James, you know what I'm saying? Right, right. And also, when I came like that, I was like moving my hips and stuff when I was listening to your little hip song. I was like, okay. Oh, <laughs> like, that's why like, it's in the mirror, like. The vibes. <laughs> it was a vibe. I was like picturing myself like in the bathroom, like hitting the thigh. Coming up to that song, like I like straight out of Bama, but I'm gonna go with I like to hypnotize a lot. Thank you. Okay, you going hypnotize then? I like to. What's up? That's what's up. Don't get it twisted, T. James. All your music been fire, and that that straight out of Bama was lit. Like your lyrics are lit. Like you have a a, a talent. It's the delivery. I ain't gonna lie to you. The way you rapping on this bitch. Like, it made me go like, all right, man, you need to be, you know, a little bit more with your delivery. Like, that's how I make me feel, so. Yeah. Gotta get right. tilt my that, hat. Um, that also remind me of, oh, like, Bust Rhymes and it gave me a little. It gave me a little vibe. I ain't gonna bullshit. It gave me a little vibe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's, That's one of my favorites. That's one of my favorites. So I appreciate that. Yeah. Um. All right. So they got T. James on uh, the world. Now it's on YouTube, so I might have a little uh, ad coming up. No, it didn't. Hey. It's time to start getting it real, money, man. Yeah. Hey, DJ, break right. I'm gonna give you the world, the money and the fame, cold, the cars man. and the clothes, everything. I'm gonna give you the world, what you could hey, only dream. It used to be a dream, so swear I dream. I'm gonna you. give you the world, yeah. no more money problems. Tell mama I got it, it's a problem. Said, I'm gonna give you the world. Somewhere got you looking real fancy Look Let's fly and see our ancestors Babe, do some romantic Shit, fuck it If you want to, baby We can lead a planet go. I'm low nights in the yo When you thought I was in some panties It's finally paying off Now I'm gonna put you in that lambing Bar. It's finally paying off Now I got plans for my family I do. We bout to board a plane And go and get back in Miami I wanna thank God That he blessed me with this talent thank Told you. my brother let's hit the mall Fuck it, nigga, let's do Sofa next to Oprah by this time I'm married Taking trips across seas with my same I'm bad bitch the, world, hey. the money and the fame The cars right. and the clothes, everything I'm gonna give you the world What you put hey, on the dream It used to be a dream, so where I dream I'm gonna give you the world yeah. No more money problems Tell mama I got bad. it's a problem Said, I'm gonna give you the world Hey, Daddy, you know I ain't forgot you. You know that you my partner. Keep 
couple items. Might take you a vacation on one getaway from this violence. That shit make you feel good just to see your mama smile. That shit make you feel better just to know that your kids straight. Show my daughters things I never seen like the better way. Let's wake up in Japan, I go to sleep in Italy. Good times, no JJ, just some hood memories. It was times when it went none none of that criminal tree. I had to get up on my ass, start selling criminal tree. Hard work pays, I'm grinding with no days out. I wanna live life without a care, feeling like a maid boss. Maids cleaning up the house, remember sleeping on the couch. Now we just pull up and hop out, shit we can't even pronounce. No more money problems. Tell mama I got us. I promise. Said I'ma give you the world. I got to. And I'ma give you the world. That shit was dope, yay! Yeah. A song for your mama. If mama ain't happy, ain't nobody happy. And then nobody. Yeah, the, the the mama is everything, and the baby girls is everything. Mm -hmm. You want to give them the world? I love that song. It's like very Aladdin vibes. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like because mm -hmm. you're you're talking to the women in your family. They they uphold you, and that's beautiful. That too. Give <laughs> me like a five. All right, so we got uh so soon with our uh, fuck boy. Oh, this gonna be tough. <laughs> Open your Zoom, join my room, me and I D for me and you. Grab you some wine, your toys and some lube. Damn, you look fine, enjoying your boo. Tango Ray and Pepsi for me. I Langeray sexy for me, I presume. Pandemic heavy, wish we were immune. X in your belly, here comes the boom. Speak in the belly, wanna uh in your womb. Shake in your belly, like a schmuckers crew. Talking to me dirty, got me in the mood. Open up your center like Mario the Mule. Looking like Maya and a king in a view. Looking like prime rib, must be consumed. Knock on the door, I'm like, must we conclude? Her man walks in, how fucking rude. I need a fork, I need a knife. I need a bad beat, don't need a wife. I need a mic. This beat's up, boy. I wanna beat the beat, I'm a fuck boy. I need a fork, I need a knife. I need a bad beat, don't need a wife. I need a mic. This beat's up, boy. I wanna beat the beat, I'm a fuck boy. She said, break me up, hey, show me what you got. Yikes. She said, break me up, show me what you got. Crikey. She said, break me up, show me what you got. She said, Yo, this that quarantine cocktail, that hot tip when the stock fell. You gon' spend that check on some new checks or invest in a thought? Well, your baby mama in my DM sending me eggplant emojis and crotch shots. I call it hot mail. I might beat before I body this beat. If I do, how's it looking for you? My nigga, not well. Hit it, then I hit her with some leftover oxtail. This got premium porn hub for free shit. You at home by your damn self, now you need dick. If I rock the boat like a Leah, you gon' be seasick. Drowning in the Rona, I wanna know if you're gonna ride the wave like Sabrina with Idris or Flea Ship. Rethink, I can read this. The beat been talking mad shit like my shot ain't on Jesus. Shut the word if I cuddle first to catch her while I'm sleeping. Sneak up on the sense season's greetings. Santa's in your chimney, batteries in your stock, and you produce all the sudden. Is decent, let's get it poppin'. Ah, drop mic for charity. Randy Watson is that audio sexual chocolate. Watch this. Once I body this, you'll be hard pressed to not snitch. It's obvious I'm toxic, but not sick. <laughs> I need a fork, I need a knife. I need a bad beat, don't need a wife. I need a mic. This beat's up, boy. I wanna beat the beat, I'm a fuck boy. I need a fork, I need a knife. I need a bad beat, don't need a wife. I need a mic. This beat tough, boy. I wanna beat the beat, I'm a fuck boy. She said, break me up, show me what you got. <laughs> you better stop, girl. She said, break me up, show me what you got. Damn. She said, break me up, show me what you got. My God, my God, my God. She said, break me up, show me what you got. Cause I don't want no Coronavirus. Tonight, I'ma give it to you. <laughs> <laughs> 
Alright, so I think that was uh, round four right there. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's, that was hella dope too, so soon, you know? Yeah, that was real creative, man. That shit beat creative. going crazy. Yeah. <laughs> I could see the uh, the fork and the knife going, beating on the table, talking about give me my mic and shit. Like, I like that. It's definitely creative. Thank I'm going to uh, go so soon to set up the fifth round. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only reason? No, 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 it was crazy. <laughs> they, they, quiet, they quiet, man. They quiet. Yeah, but that, yeah, that shit, oh, no, 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 no. I ain't quiet. I, I let everybody get their chance to talk. Then I, you know, because I don't want to be talking so much. I said, I picked, I picked them on this round because that, that Missy, that Missy, uh, sample was crazy, man. And, yeah. You know, you know how I feel about that sample, but, 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 I, got, I don't know. It's just something about that hook on, like, the world, like, the I'm a world. Yeah, but you know, T not he not fucking up with his rapping. He gonna rap on that. He gonna go. His delivery is not. He don't. He not missing with that. But you know how I feel I about know. that. You know, you know how I feel about that damn fuck boy. I told you about that the first time we met when I listened to it. So I do. It, it, it is a cheat code too, though, because it got <laughs> it got something we know now, and then we got. <laughs> That's why. That's why I got. I got to give T. James this point because well, I, I, I can't. I can't hold him because he had used that. You know what I'm saying? Right. And that 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 is still in my head. That I was that. I'm. I'm actually mad at T. James because I just tried to look for it and it's not on stream. So I'm actually kind of. I still give you the point. You did it. <laughs> it's on it YouTube. Like, it's on YouTube though. I seen, I seen it on YouTube. That's why I went. I just went okay. added to my favorites on YouTube. But like that is just still right now. It's, I'm talking and it's in my head. So like. But that fuck boy is tough too, though. So, but yeah. I, I roll with Thank PJ you. in the world. That shit is in my head right now. That bit is hard. Like that's that's a to me a classic song. Even though it, even though it's say four years ago, and I didn't know TJ, so I'm just not hearing this. But to me, I feel like I can listen to that. You know what I'm saying? Again, like that's like one of those. Pieces, you know what I'm saying? Like I really like this song a lot. No cap. I get so soon my uh my point because it was like on point. Like, think about what he was talking about in the beginning, like, into the Zoom room. Was, you know what I'm saying? He was just like, it, it already fit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Quarantine music, period. Yep. Right. Uh, Chad and Hershey? I like I like the Missy sample. Yeah, the song was fire, but I love that Give give give, give You the World. T. James hit it on the head, you know. That's definitely a relatable song. Right. Yeah. But I definitely like the Missy sample. The, the fuck thank boy. you for that coronavirus. That fuck boy, so. <laughs> My point is so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, the thing is, the thing is with me, like, anybody could take a uh, Missy sample and fuck it up. But, he but can you fuck it up? He fucked it up. He yeah, he fucked it up. Everybody can't do that. He yeah. did it. So, yeah, he did. You know what Yo, listen. And I, and I he wanna, got I bars just, for days too. I, thank you. I appreciate you, yeah. That means a lot because I really fuck with your music. Like this, this is this is it's an enjoyable like battle because like you're an enjoy you're an, I like I enjoy your music like genuinely. It's like, it's like no. battle of the bars in different styles. Yeah, the styles are so different. You know what I'm saying? But I really I'm I thoroughly am enjoying like being in battle with you. But what I will say real quick is that what I appreciate about that song is it's part of my most current album. And um, it's the first project that I've recorded on my own. I recorded and did a, a not a full mix. I sent it to an engineer who was much more of a professional than I am. But so it gave me the opportunity to like, it wasn't the engineer who put that in. It was me and I, I had the vision to uh, Hershey talked about the the Cardi coronavirus. Like I like <laughs> I, I, I wrote the lyrics and then I felt like okay, it needs these little touches because I wanted to bring in like uh, pop culture cu current references that really spoke to what's happening with the quarantine and everything. And and so I really thoroughly enjoyed that. So I appreciate you picking up on that, Hershey, and and I appreciate everybody loving. It. I don't care that that the majority chose C James' song because it's a dope record. But I appreciate y'all. Like seeing the nuances in the art because the art is very important to me. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. I might be on the couch right now though, but you know, so it's, it's I don't care. It's cool. It's worth it. It's worth it because hey, C James got. Say, hey, you can tell uh, you can tell y'all lady y'all had a great battle though, man. This shit close, man. Yeah, 
Yeah, it is. This shit neck and neck, man. <laughs> Don't put a nope. nigga on the bed and he ain't get blue out. <laughs> <laughs> right. so Did you hear what he said? Nigga going Don't put a nigga on the bed if he ain't got blue out there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so last round, man, before we get up out of here. We've been running. I'm a this shit raw, though. Uh, T. James. This shit go hard. You got to do better. You got to come try these flavors. Got several. Come on. One session with me and come check out his eyes. That's where he's a man with the devil. Shit. We only buy press on sale. Uh-uh. The plug drop him off on the scale. He said T. James, your pants be flying. They might need to hire you at Delta. Trapaholics, what's happening? Yeah. The British squad yeah. young and slim dash and snap that Bruce. motherfucker back. Bruce. Squad. Bruce. pressure for sure kind of like you know on the field being in the huddle you know what i'm saying very sporty you got that um, too. i like that <laughs> oh, you should license that miss hot uh, miss hip-hop got a good point you should license that record bro that yeah. shit been like madden are they still putting out maddens like that that yeah. shit like a madden oh, yeah. record, two, three record something but that shit would be good for like or any show or movie that's like sports related. That shit, yeah, yeah for sure. For real, you bro. Never thought about that, but it's true. Hell yeah. yeah. You play that shit on power or something, man. That's a tough <laughs> ass record. <laughs> They're my show, man. I will always say you play that shit on power. <laughs> All right. So we got a long game to finish us out, man. Oh, man. Oh, we are gonna wait to the end. I know Meg got something to say. <laughs> All right, this long game was so soon. It's gonna we're gonna take us out right here. I said my ancestors ain't fight for me to be taking shit from no crackers. I said.
said, I said, I said, my ancestors ain't fight for me to be taking shit from no crackers. Got that bishop up in they chest. That's what got my king and queen captured. Running through the shoots and climbing up ladders. Trying to duck the noose they used to free taggers. Traveling the roots to move to free status. Had to be the best at hide and seek. Shamalama. My ancestors ain't die for me to be answering to no masses. These labels trying to own rappers. Shitty contracts to control your masters. Running back hell, Mary and your passion. Leave you with no line to block the no tackle. If the niggas fail to sell your shit, when them two hands touch you, oh, they gon' sack you. Sheesh. Just jealousy and breed savages that breed black on black crime narrative. So the white on white crime averages with sleeves your feeds and IG statuses. The Karen biz getting embarrassing. You wanna fuck for pain like a masochist. These so and so's need their asses whip like descriptive nouns need adjectives. My ancestors inside of me gave me strategies like battleship. Get a legal weapon if you have to press it. Shoot them three times. That's a haddish trick. We got trolls bigger than six nine. Cause misery loves company. But if a troll comes for me in fixed time, please remember that when they come for me. Wrong game. Wrong game. Wrong game. Wrong game. Wrong game. If you weak, if you weak, can't endure pain. Can't endure pain. Can't endure pain. Long game. Long game. Wrong game. Wrong game. If you weak, can't endure pain. My ancestors ain't died for me to be taking shit from no crackers. You want me to preach peace? But my frequency is on ratchet. Don't wanna protest when a whole ratchet. Don't wanna hold tap a whole balance. Every chant for white lies, a rant of white lies. So we show them that black lives matter. Last night I had a dream. The cops were harassing me. Talking slick while passing me. Then they followed me, turned me to tragedy. Had the full deck of cars against humanity. I saw Hannity with a camera team. They had tanks bigger than masterpiece. With no limits when they blast for me. Nah, I ain't even supposed to be here. You're a play risk with my continent. The consequence, Africans overseas here. 400 years reaped so for free here. Just to be a working class trope and street gear. I'm gonna give it citizenship to blacks. I'm going back, bitch. I don't want my soul to breathe here. So to be clear, it's what I declare. I'll go blind, be assured I see clear. I'll show my cards and load my three pair. Never on guard, fold like rich chair. Then I'll pack up and go like street fair. Take all my shit just to be fair. The soul food we cook, the clothes that we wear. Invest resources back home. I'll repair. We don't need apologies. We prefer apostrophes. Equity, economy, community, chess, monopoly. Reparations, reciprocity. Property, not poverty. College degrees, college free. Stock options, tell the cops, stop watching me. Manhunt's done, Ali oxen free. Will they take heed? Probably not. So we eavesdrop from the treetops. Learn their tactics, teach the peapods how to draw two and land those speed knots. Let the beat drop, tell these street cops. If you bleed blue, we pass, please stop. If we steal the bacon, please. Please don't be shocked. Shoot on on blacks, you might be shocked. My ancestors still ride for me. Keep me elevated like a game of taps. When our eyes are stacked in the game of life, they still got my bones like a game of crap. Will you blame the white boy or blame the foul catch? Cause misery is so comfortable. While you miserable, guess who's making mouse traps? Remember that when they come for you. Long game. Long game. Long game. Long game. If you weak, if you weak, can't endure pain. Can't endure pain. Can't endure pain. Long game. Wrong game. Wrong game. If you weak, can't endure pain. Brother Blake got seven in his back. His three children watch as he collapsed. Little Kyle running with the strap. Wouldn't have made it home if he was black. Went from duck, 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 goose to duck hunt. Buck, buck, shoot. When we die, it's fuck the proof. Dig up dirt for fucked up news. Fuck the news. Fuck the cops. Fuck the system that fails us. Boycott jump shots till they arrest the cops that kill Sister Taylor. Boycott, jump shot, so they arrest the cops to kill Sister Taylor. Bro, I'm not, I'm not great in this shit. Oh, <laughs> that's not fair, man. That, that's just not fair. I'm not great in this shit. That one right there, that, that, you snapped them out. Dude. Hell yeah. 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 Them out. I ain't gonna lie to you. I done had all my pieces this time. I don't know if I'm necessarily gonna pick on that one. I ain't gonna lie to you. Um, it's it's so hard. Like I said, T he he not missing on no rap shit. Like he does not. Like he is delivering like perfect. And like and even like I'm I'm just realized what what your natural voice sound remind me of so soon. And I don't know if nobody ever told you this. And I'm surprised Miguel ain't bringing up. I know I'm the youngest in here, but I know I thought Miguel would have brought this up. Maybe he did before. But your voice kind of put you in the mind of Childish Gambino. Just the, I heard that before. 
I've heard that before. It's your natural voice. Could I said that one time when I was thinking about it, but it, it went out the window after I thought about it. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> and then like even my homeboy, he's just like, hey, dude, kind of sound like Charles Gilbert. I said, I thought the same thing. Like, it's voice, your natural voice just sounds like, put you in the mind. And, and it's so crazy because you 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 rap. You don't, you know, you don't necessarily go in there and try to sing. You actually go in there and rap. And that's just your natural voice. Like your natural voice just sounds like that. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I don't even know why I want to, you know, put my point on that particular last one, last two. I don't know. I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't want to, man. I don't want to grade this shit, man. <laughs> no, I definitely would. No, I definitely would, because I'd be like, nah, I don't want more no time with me. But no, I really don't know where to put my point. Like, I ain't gonna lie to you. Like, the thing is with the challenge Gambino, I, I know he put me in the mind of Gambino, but my thing is like this is what we're doing with with y'all, I don't want to compare y'all to that. That man oh, yeah. that made his money over and over and over again. If, if the thing was, I'd rather him put a spin on on Childish Gambino sway yeah. and make it his own, and that way he yeah. can be recognized, you know, for what he do. I don't want. Come on, don't get me wrong. I don't like no, this, I'm talking about pure voice. We're not talking about no creativity. We're not talking about the thing, things that he do. No, music. I see James gave me voice. like um, Sauce Walker vibes on that last one too. Oh. Okay, I can see that on that last, yeah. But see, yeah, I, I, I get why you wouldn't want to do that as an artist because you didn't want, you know, necessarily want to be compared well, to I'm, that one. I'm not- I'm not offended because artists that I get compared to, I just have the utmost respect for. And I'm not, I'm not, I'm not even honestly, like, I'm not looking for commercial success. That's, that's never been my goal. So like, I, I, I guess that I'm probably a few years older than Childish, but like he's successful and, and not a lot of people know me in comparison to him. So the times that people have made that comparison, I, I have, I, I feel honored that people even would make that comparison, you know what I'm saying? So I like even listening to T James, I get Jeezy vibes, but Jeezy couldn't out rap T James. Like he just couldn't do it. Like uh, Jeezy's been rap- for me. And Jeezy at his best couldn't out rap T James. Like T James has the 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 the, the vocal tones of, of Jeezy and and and, uh, and, and accent. I heard that so it's a little similar. It sound everything sounds similar to me, even if it's not. But you couldn't out rap T James if he tried, and that's not disrespect to uh, Jeezy when he's done with his career. But T James brings that that sound with the bars, and and I just I, I, that's why when like Miguel told me like you're going against T James, I was like, all right, let me listen and see what I'm going against, and I was like, oh, like. <laughs> this is not gonna be a- <laughs> this is gonna be some shit. <laughs> they said it, bro. Yeah. Listen, Paul, what you got, man? I know hey, this is your podcast. Um well, I mean you're on my podcast, but um your podcast, <laughs> speak your mind. You always you always reviewing music and, and shit like that, man. This is your sway. Oh, I mean you got the you got the boom box behind you. So um, you know what I'm saying? So, so it, <laughs> um know you enjoy like- yourself. I definitely enjoyed myself. This is my shit or whatever. Just listening to music because it tell a lot about the artist as a as an individual and an entertainer. You know what I'm saying? That's why I said one fair, like because it was two different styles. It's crazy. It's like one Tokyo, you feel me, and one American style. It's like wait a minute, it's too different. Hold on, and this shit is raw though. Like everybody that was here that presented music tonight is very talented. One way or the other, uh, on different levels, this shit is just dope or whatever, and I can't wait to like the battle too and shit like that. Right. Um, I think, one. yeah, I can't wait to battle too. But I, my my point go to so soon. I, right. I'm not great this shit, man. Y'all gotta draw for me, man. Fuck that. But I hate I to do, do this. Listen, listen. I I I, I do it because. I can hear T. James' music, like I said, on power and pocket. I can anybody can go play apply pressure any fucking where, and um, and you could go play so soon shit at the next fucking protest, bro. Yeah, documentaries and shit. You talking about power? Who I cannot pick between that shit, man. But listen, though, <laughs> even though, like you talking about T. James, I, I like how you put your cover back there. That's hard. But what I was gonna say, um, like the way you talk about, um, you put T. James on power. Believe it or not, growing up, I'm watching TV. And still, I'm 23 now. I'm watching TV. 
They're not playing. They don't. I don't. I don't get nothing about uh, at Birmingham, Alabama. I'm getting New York shit. So who I'm hearing? I'm hearing artists like So Soon on the back of this. They run it down. They run it down the subway. I'm hearing shit that sound like So Soon. Mm -hmm. I'm seeing backgrounds that look like the background of Miss Hip Hop, Miss Hip Hop uh, uh, screen right now. That's what yeah. I see. So it's just it is what it is. Where you are, you know what I'm saying. So I appreciate them both. Now normally I wouldn't do that. I would actually give uh, you know what I'm saying pick a person. But I, honestly, between those two songs. I, it's just hard to like, you know, but like I, I said, it's all about- I can see both of those play. songs at the, at the top echelon or, or whatever they was trying to do with that song. Yeah. If James wanted to score that song to a movie, he could do it. If um, So Soon wanted to, wanted to play that shit at a Black at Black Live Rally, yeah. um, Black Live Matter Rally, he could do that shit. So, I mean, like, that's just, mm -hmm. it's, it's hard for me. I, I, it makes it hard I think, um, I think, opposing styles made it that much more fun and the fact that we come from different regions and so the sounds are different because like the thing with me is like look we know hip -hop, hip hop music started in new york and and i wear that with a badge of honor while recognizing that like new york doesn't have a say in in the trends we're following what's happening in commercial hip hop like new trends happen and there might be one or two artists from new york that follow it so hard that they become commercial as a result of their following, but we're not setting the trends anymore. And I'm not mad at that. There's like people that are my age and older who like get mad at, I'm not because that's where evolution is. When, wherever you come from, if you hear, see, whatever, something, and you take it and make it to the next level, that's all that matters. So I'm not, I'm personally not bothered by that, but the fact that I got to, like be in this space against Keith James and I heard his music and was just like real like amazed like yo this dude I feel his struggles I feel everything he's talking about he got bars the beat selection is dope the visuals for some of the songs that he has that I happen to watch were fire like he has the potential to be uh like honestly chat T James and Met like all three, I have the the, the music y'all make your the the your appeal. Y'all have the potential to really be commercial if that's what you're looking to do. And so, even, like, just listening to all three of y'all music was just enjoyable, and being a part of this was enjoyable. Like seriously, yours too, yours too, brother. I agree. Hell of fire. I'm going to shoot a double count out, man. Don't <laughs> double count out. Both y'all hit each other with a chill. <laughs> hey, everybody win. Yeah, everybody win. I'm not mad at that. This was what I wanted it to be when I envisioned it, man. I had a lot of ambition with this project. Um, Hershey, what you got? Huh? Oh, yeah, what chat thought? What you thought? It's the time, man. He wrong for that shit. <laughs> I know. That's what I said. Shit. <laughs> Both of them got a point for me then. Both of them fucking, let me tell you like this. Both, everybody in the room is, is welcome back, but I'm saying them two is welcome back any fucking time to do a fucking track or track or whatever like that. Just really? because, I mean, even y'all two, y'all went like, anyways, fuck that. Is that chat snacks behind you right there? <laughs> yes, sir. Y'all want to plug your shit, man. <laughs> I got, I got look, you. I got, you know, I got, I got you. Send me your address. <laughs> well, plug your shit, man. Tell what you're doing, shit, man. Tell everybody. Oh man, these these the chat snacks. These the great trippy snacks. You feel me? So uh, mm -hmm. yeah, tap in with me. I send you a box. Send y'all a little sample box. Hey, send me your address, I like and I get you something to the house for sure. Now mm -hmm. you gotta send me your address. I ain't gonna hound you for your address because I'm giving out free <laughs> shit now. <laughs> hit me up, I'm hit you up. <laughs> uh, shit, TJ's man. Um, trapping made it happen. That's coming out next week. You know I got to get you on for the six. We're going to talk about that. But, you know, any, yeah. promo, any ideas you got on, on the process of making all Trapper Made It Happen? Man, you said any promo? No, any, any ideas, like any thoughts on the album? Like, what are your thoughts on that new album? Oh, man, I, I'm, I'm ready for the drop, man. Y'all go get that on. It's going to be on all platforms next Friday. It's Trapper Made It Happen. Y'all go get that, man. I'm... I, it's my first one. I didn't drop them by the year. I took a year off and just dropped straight videos out here this year. So I'm coming back cool. with a new mixtape, man. Y'all go check that out. Cool, I got a song with Black Youngster too, man. Y'all go. For real? Me. Yeah, yeah I, I got a song with Black Youngster and Finesse two times. That's dope. That's dope. Yeah. But the thing about T. James is, man, you said you ain't, you ain't dropped the album a year, but you was busy as fuck in 2020. Yeah. And we're going to talk about that, man. You you was active as fuck. And you got credit for that from uh, D. Doolin and everybody. All in the city yeah. and shit like that, man. You was busy, dude. I, 
Nice. Yeah. Um, Hershey, uh, man, let me first of all, let me thank all y'all, man, for just even participating. Um, believing in, in the idea that I had to do this. I could have got a lot of pressure from uh verses or whatever, like ah, oh, you just doing another version. But I wanted to do it for, for the artists that I know, you know what I'm saying? The artists that exactly. I'm, I'm familiar with, people that I know, people I reach out with, reach out to and they um they they hit me back, you know what I'm saying? I can't I can't go reach out to Shantel, go reach out to uh I don't neither do I want to either. I can't go reach out to TJ. I'm a TI <laughs> and shit like that. I don't want to. They done made their money. So I'm really trying to like, you know what I'm saying, promote, promote, promote. You know, that's what the, that's part of the pillars of the podcast, man, is just to a create a platform, man, for real. Yeah. And that's Miguel, tough. you really did your thing or whatever. You like the yeah, late yeah. night podcast and shit, you know. Motherfuckers will be trying to check you out on Facebook late at night, like <laughs> after hours I'll and be shit. Up. I'll be up, man. I'll be up. <laughs> Uh, Hell yeah. You think you can take us out of here with one more uh, Tales from the Club? Wait, 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 wait. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I just got to say this. This is super important. The fact that we all came together on the first day of the new year after the fucking challenging year that 2020 was, like, I thank all of y'all because y'all, everybody that's in this, I'm looking at beyond my own screen i'm looking at an additional six screens and we all came ready to have fun and be professionals and i appreciate everybody who was here tonight this was so much fun so much talent and not just us four artists but also miss hip-hop who reached out to me in 2020 and and had me um, featured on her stuff in a few different ways, and she is just killing it with the podcast game right now. And because of Miss Hip Hop, I, I met Miguel. Miguel reached out to me, and we I did your show, and you are seriously about your shit and killing the podcast game as well. And then Hershey, who was a, a, a co-feature when I was also on your show last week and you are about your shit. I learned so much just listening to your stories last week when we were on the Just Chillin' podcast last week. So it's not just us for artists, but everybody who is in this, I appreciate y'all. Like this was time well spent. And like, I, I just wanted to like vocally to everybody express my appreciation for being in this space and this time. Cause this was so much fun. And the talent is crazy. I'm going to be plugging Matt. I'm going to be plugging chat. I'm going to be plugging T. James on my, yeah. on my live, like on my on my um, IG stories and everything. And just be listening to them the same way I listen to artists that I'm like, that are commercial that I'm familiar with. Because we are trying to get that bag the way they are. And we need us. So like kudos to y'all. Keep making this fucking amazing music that y'all are making. And to Miss Hip Hop and Miguel and Hershey, who's co-hosting with Miguel for a couple of episodes, <laughs> keep making these dope ass podcasts because yeah. people want the content, and all we got to do is crack the code. That's it. That's all we got to do, and it's hard, but it's not hard. It's just no, the grind no, no. and the commitment. So thank you to all y'all, seriously. For sure, thank you, brother, for real. Thank you so soon, so dope. Y'all yeah, go follow me. Oh, oh for sure. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. The link gonna be oh, real. Uh, Hershey, take us out of here, man. You got it. You got yeah, man. Instagram for take and chats too. I need chats, and I got. I think I got Miss Hip Hop now. She added me, but I don't my Instagram, I my got Instagram, you. double R T James, double like D O U B L E R uh -huh. underscore T James. I'm gonna follow everybody back. And then chat with yours. Uh, at official Chastity Lindsay. Send me yours. I'll follow you real quick, actually. I'm about to do it now. I want them chat snacks. I ain't saying. <laughs> I got you. I'm serious. Send me your address. I'll tap y'all in. I truly appreciate y'all for real. Even if you only indulge, you can bless a family member so and, and let me know what they say. I know they're going to send me some good feedback. Chat, tell your IG one more time and Matt, put, tell yours as well, please. It's at official Chastity Lindsay, C H A S S I D Y L I N D S E Y. I had I T Y. That's why I missed it. Okay, you got a hashtag that came up 
right above your name. So I, I just followed you. And Matt, please tell yours as well. Big Dripper. That's B-I-G dot or period. How you use it in Dripper. D-R-I-P-P-E-R. Got you, got you, got you. Get that one more time. Big Dripper. B-I-G dot E-R-I-P-P-E-R. Okay, I got you. Uh, damn, bro. We already following each other. Nah, I just follow. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm ready. For, I'm ready for her story. I'm. I'm a. You going to see me? Check us out. Both got it. Um, I kind of got uh, last night was actually a story to tell. I guess I was um, I was on stage and I was naked. And there was this dude, he kept bugging the stage. Like, he kept coming. I was dancing with, like, one of my partners that I work with. And first, he was, like, harassing her. But he didn't have, like, he wasn't tipping or nothing. So I was like, you know, back up off stage, my nigga. Like, you're not tipping. You're not throwing no money. Like, move. Like, everybody that over here, there's nobody this close to the stage that's actually tipping. But your broke ass. Like, move. You know what I'm <laughs> so then um, I was dancing with another girl, and he walked up to the stage, and he was saying something. And it was like just one of the moments where, you know, when a guy bugging you, you just don't pay him no attention. And she was just like, bye. You know what I'm saying? I was like, yeah, bye, you know? And then right before we closed, again, I was naked. So I was like twerking or whatever. And dudes were throwing their money. And I felt something wet between my butt. And I like jumped up and pushed the shit out this nigga. Like, what the fuck are you doing? As they say in New York, you OD and son. Like, the fuck? Mm -hmm. And then... My dude was there, so he see me push the dude, like, so he didn't walk over there all smooth, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he don't even know my nigga didn't peep the whole situation. I'm like, you might want to go home or just go to your seat, sir, because you finna have a whole issue because you want to be here broke and touching on girls that don't want to be touched on by your ass, like, and that was just so, I hate, I hate guys that make it like that for other guys because it makes us not want to, like, because dancing is an art form, you know what I'm saying? Like, whoever comes and they enjoy it and they bring the money to enjoy that and support the hustle and all that, I'm with that. But dudes like that, I was just like, and it just reminds me of like the first time I started dancing, like my first ever private dance, a dude literally licked me up my ass and I was so offended. I was like, you don't even know me. You don't know what's back there. You know what I'm saying? And it kind of like made me go, sometimes I'll be like, I wish I had something in my ass for this nigga. You know what I'm saying? I so he threw some water on your ass, the dude on stage. That's face. what I finna ask. He threw some water on your ass. Face in my ass. Bro. No, oh, my God. God. The guy last night. The guy last night. What did he do? What the fuck was that? He, I don't. He fucking tripped out. He must have been on some shit, or that's just his personality. Either way, I don't care. I don't fuck around like that. That shit was nasty as hell. I was like, he put his face in your ass last night. Last night on, I was on stage. This wasn't even in private. This was like, Lord, of, like everybody was sitting there watching me dance, and he just decided, I'm gonna do this. And then when I pushed him, he act like he didn't know what the problem was. He was throwing off on some on some pills or some shit. He wasn't throwing off on shit. He was just a stupid <laughs> little dude. A stupid <laughs> little dude that didn't know how to fucking behave himself at the strip club. And next time he go, I hope that he learned a lesson that, I don't know, I think the, the stigma of dancers is totally different from what it really is because we are very respectable young women, believe it or not. I mean, I get ratchet or whatever, I mean, blah, 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 blah. but at the end of the day, we don't like that kind of stuff. Like, men really think we like that because we we are so willing to take our clothes off and dance for y'all that y'all think anything goes up in that bitch and it's not like that. You know right. what You can't be going licking strangers on the ass. That's nasty. Y'all pay attention. I think that's what you, you want to talk about. Shit. That's what it is. You want to talk about ass and you try to get me last. We're time. not talking about that, but if you want to, we can talk about <laughs> it. <laughs> that's what you trying to do. Bring it back to last week. <laughs> that's what she really that's tried to do. Last week, I like that, but I don't like no stranger walking up to me. Licking me uh, in my butt. Yeah, all serious. That shit's 